from ABC News, This Week with George Stephanopoulos, starts now. Hello, everyone, and welcome to ABC's This Week with George Stephanopoulos. I'm Jim Crawford, filling in for George Stephanopoulos. He is off today. Let's begin with our top stories this week. A cat has been found and adopted by new family members in Wausau, Wisconsin. However, its previous owners have died. And the cat's name was was a uh, uh, hold on a second. Okay, guys, we seem to be have we seem to be having problems here. Uh, what's the cat's name? Uh, I think. Oh yeah. Sorry about that, guys. I had to think first. The cat's previous name was Lucy, a female orange cat with a black spot on its tail. But, the cat's name has been changed to Mary by the adopted family. Now, speak of the black spot on its tail, there's a little black spot on the, on the very tip of the tail. It was born like that. It's only 10 years old. And today happens to be its birthday. It just turned 10 years old on this day, June 4th. It was born Mary, the cat, was born on this day 10 years ago, back in 2004. Now, however, its little black spot on the tail, the very tip of the tail, is still there. So I wish the cat, Mary, whose new name is now Mary, the very best luck with his, with his or I should, I should say with her family, adopted owners of the cat. Sorry about that guys, it's a she. Mary is a girl's name, not a guy's name. But whatever. And... We're doing so far on time. According to the clock, we started a few minutes ago. I say... Yep. We're good. <laughs> Our next top story is... Well, yeah. Our next top story is... A 10-year-old boy named Bob Smith was adopted after his family died. However, this is a different Smith family. Down in Madison, Wisconsin. There's a lot of Smith families around here, here in Wisconsin. But this boy lost his family in a car crash. Luckily, his grandparents are there. 
And this all took place last week, Wednesday, this past Wednesday of last week. May 28th, at 9 a.m., Bob Smith, the 10-year-old boy, was at his grandparents' house when they got a phone call saying his parents were dead. Very sad story of how this all happened. The boy was upset when he received the phone call. He wanted to see his mother and father. Bill and Jolene Smith, which I mean, it should say Bill and Jolene Smith, okay. when the phone call came around, and it was reported that they were dead. He is now with his adopted family, Tara and Jack Smith. Okay. Right? Excuse me, Tara and Jack Jones, sorry. Tara and Jack Jones, the adopted family, adopted him. But he wanted to keep his last name the same. He wanted to keep the last name Smith. And so, that's what he's going to continue to be called by. Bob Smith. The adopted child after the loss of his family. In a car crash. Alright. We are going to take a very quick break. We'll be right back after this. Bring the thrill of the catch straight to their bowl with Frisky's Seafood Sensations. Now with new shrimp flavor. Frisky's. Feed the senses. Oh, 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 let's go. Oh, 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 la, 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 Some things just go together, like auto and home insurance. Bundle them together at Progressive and you save big on both. Stop talking. Perfectly paired savings. Now that's progressive. Today's charter tip, bring your shows with you. Watching TV on the couch is great. Watching on the go is even better. As a charter customer, you can do this right now. Just download the apps from networks like HBO, CNN, and TNT at charter.net. Then watch them on your iPad, iPhone, or iPod Touch. Freedom to watch your shows on your time. One more way, charter puts you in control. Go to charter.net slash tips to get started today. Emily's just starting out and on a budget, like a ramen noodle every night budget. She thought Allstate car insurance was out of her reach until she heard about the value plan. And saving money with Allstate doesn't stop there. Kim and James are what you might call overly protective, especially behind the wheel. Nothing wrong with that. In fact, Allstate gives them a bonus twice a year for being safe drivers. Dollar for dollar, nobody protects you like Allstate. Welcome back. We do have some very sad news to report to you all. Very sad news. Bill Johnson. Story writer, excuse me, story writer and comic book stripper who wrote comic books has died. He was 82 years old. His death is unknown. He used to write comic book strips for children and wrote stories as an author of children's books. So far, 
There are no been reports on how the incident happened. That right there is a very sad story. And we will have more reports next time when we get more information. If not, we will break into programming for ABC News Special Reports and let you know if we have any more details on this guy's death. Right now he's been deceased, and that's all we know. That is going to do it for us now. I'm Jim Crawford, filling in for George Stephanopoulos. Thank you for watching. We'll see you on the next, this week. Shoot him down, turn